good morning. This is Dr. Colette, and I hope that you are doing well. Listen, I want to talk to the busy woman. So if that's you, raise your hand. Hey, busy girl, I'm talking to you. I was driving to work this morning, and I'm in the parking lot uh, preparing to go into the building. And I was thinking about something I wanted to share the other day, but did not have the opportunity to. And and as I was thinking about what I want to share, I kept thinking about this scripture. You've heard it before, and I'm going to read it in the New Living Translation. The scripture is Matthew 7, verse 6. It says, don't waste what is holy on people who are unholy. Don't throw your pearls to pigs. They will trample the pearls, then they turn and attack you. Maybe you've heard this verse before, but I was thinking about this verse and I was thinking about the principle that we can extract from this particular verse of scripture. And here is the thought, here is the concept, here is the idea that what you have is precious, busy woman, your gifts, your talents, your skills, all of who you are, it's precious. You're already busy. You're already doing so much that you can't afford to give what you have away to just anyone. And especially you can't afford to give it away to those who don't value what you possess. (laughs) Let me say that again. You cannot afford to give away what you have to those who do not value what you possess. A pearl, I love pearls. A pearl is something that's beautiful, that is precious, is decorative, it makes us feel pretty. But would you give a pearl to a pig? You wouldn't, because the pig doesn't know what to do with the pearl. The pig doesn't value the pearl. The pig doesn't know how to handle the pearl. The pig would just stomp on it, maybe eat it, maybe do a whole bunch of other stuff to it, maybe ignore it, maybe just trample on it and it just gets in the mud. You're, what you possess, what you have on the inside of you are pearls. And so this relates to the advice that you give, You're giving it to folks that don't want it. This relates to places and opportunities that are afforded to you. Are you just going anywhere or are you thinking about, can they really value what I have to offer? Listen, so I'm sharing this to the busy woman and it applies to all of us. But for you busy girls, you don't have time to waste and throw out what you have. You you got so much to do. And so you're going to have to begin to think about what things are from God or what are not? What are things that have been presented to you just to waste your time, waste your energy, waste your focus? And what are the things that God is bringing to you to advance you, to promote you, to bless you, to increase you, to enlarge you, and just to allow you to be a blessing to others? You're going to have to discern between the two in this season. Listen, in this season of my life, God is requiring more of me. And because he's requiring more of me, I cannot afford to just do everything, be anything, go anywhere and give to folks that don't value what it is I possess. And so sis, busy girl, busy woman, busy lady, stop throwing your pearls to the pigs. Stop giving what is so valuable to folks who do not appreciate it. Listen, this is your Monday motivation. I love you and I hope to see you soon on the next one. Bye-bye. And make sure you share this with someone if this has blessed you. Share it. Thank you.